All right, let's get into the mic. All right, now, actually, let's get into the mic career so I can create my first little player. All right, so I think this year, because some of the other years I went with power forward and, you know, all the other stuff. But I think this year I might go with a, I might go with a shooting guard only because just a little bit more height than a, a point guard, you know, left-handed. To be honest, my numbers are going to be double zero. Don't know why, but I just like that number. All right, so this is what I went for for my body settings. I went 6'7", I did 181 pounds, and 6'9", of wingspan, and my body shape is defined. Now, the reason why I picked that, because if you look at my finishing, now, my standing dunk, I'll be able to, you know, be decent in standing dunks. I'll be able to get contacts, and then when I get him to, like, a 99, he has, like, uh, maybe a 90-some, 90-something three-point, 90-some mid-range, we already got that, but my ball accuracy, ball handle, when I get him to 99, he have a 90 ball handle, and you see the steel, the perimeter. I'm pretty sure 87 to be good enough for this year. I, I don't know. I really don't. I don't know really that much, but this one I'm going to go with, and uh, you'll see. All right, so I tried to do the best I can for, uh, like, make it even or whatever, but as you can see for my finishing i get 24 potential upgrades 27 25 and 17 for my shooting playmaking and defense now for me the way i did my setup i just basically did 85 or 95 or you know stuff stuff that ended up with five because when it gets when you get to 99 i thought like i don't know if they still got it but if you get to 99 i'm pretty sure you do five up i thought so I can probably upgrade off of that and then get the 90s of what I need. But if I can't, I still think this build will be pretty good because it's like almost 80 everything. And uh, yeah. Now with this build, I, I probably would be more. I'm trying to probably be more of a winner shoot and uh, shoot dribble and like dunk or mainly shoot and dunk. Okay, so with this build, I will probably go with the spot up precision. Only because, again, I don't really know too much about this. Uh, the, I don't know nothing about it, really the jump shots, nothing. So maybe since for the spot up position, since I can just just move around and may hopefully time it right and just green everything. That's the reason why I'm picking that for my secondary. I'll probably go with like a slash and takeover to be honest. Maybe um, I'll probably go with the finishing moves. So you know, it say it helps absorb and so I can get more contact dunks and alley oops. So. I would I was actually kind of thinking about the easy blow box because I could just try to I guess I don't know if it's an extra speed boost I just drive right past them but I also got to think about centers and stuff so maybe I'll just go with the finishing moves you know it's just a test see how it is a two-way threat see again first time ever doing this I just go off of what I know from past previous stuff so I made a two-way threat, the shades of Kobe, Clay Thompson, and Tyrese. I don't, I, to be honest, I don't know who Tyrese is, but I'm about to test the build out right quick. Maybe I have a few clips or something in it, because it's not really that, that deep. Okay, now the last one is my defense. Right time, I'm gonna fix the right time. Damn, well, they, uh, they got a minute. Oh, I broke him. Oh, green, that green. Oh, hey, I ain't gonna lie. That All right, we're in the neighborhood. Uh, I'm 60. To be honest, I think this year I probably like try my hardest to grind off camera, like in my career and stuff like that. So uh, I'll probably do that. But for right now, I maybe spend like five dollars or something. I don't know. But for right now, I'll probably just go find clothes and stuff. Well, actually, hold on. I seen that these people uh like thought that they had freaking suits and stuff that I saw. So I wanna actually I wanna have a suit this year. Okay, here it is. The what's the name the blazer and stuff that you can wear suits now. I'm happy about that. I actually don't really want to wear a suit, so it's probably be the only thing y'all see me rocking neighborhood if I'm being real honest.
But actually, I'm about to go and buy some stuff for uh to buy some different suits. So after I go find it, we're uh, about to get straight into it. But I like the way next gen looks though, it's people walking around, you know, sitting down, eating. But, uh, let's find the suits. Hey, what's up, oh, man? and you can also just walk in just like that. That also is pretty good to me too. But how do I buy stuff? But I'm gonna just go ahead and buy this suit, you know. <laughs> Alright, well, 2K. I mean, if. <laughs> Alright, well. This was the first part, you know what I'm saying? The first little half of the video because, you know, just seeing everything about this in 2K22. And uh, now it's time to go over to current gen to see how current gen is. Oh, right, YouTube, I did kind of messed up and I didn't record my voice throughout the whole time me playing current jam, but this will be my build that I'm using. And uh, I'll probably cut the video almost like right here, but uh, this will be the build that I'll be using. And yeah, hopefully I can get good with this build and you already seen the next gen build, so. All right, well, YouTube, uh this probably will be the end of the video because again my mic and stuff i don't know what happened my mic and stuff wouldn't freaking say anything wasn't talking so this will probably be the end of the video you know you can still see in the back what current gen looks like but uh yeah this is what current gen look like this might be the end of the video so i uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure you like comment subscribe and stay tuned for the next video because next video i'll probably actually play games maybe <laughs> peace